वेलकम टू द सेकेंड मेन वीडियो ऑफ द डोजिट फॉर्म सो लेट स्टार्ट आवर मेन टॉपिक वट इज ड्रग इन दिस सीरीज वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस ड्रग विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू द डोजिज फॉर्म इन अ वेरी सिंपल वे सो वी विल नॉट गो टू इन इट्स कंप्लेक्स डेफिनेशन वी विल बेसिकली टेक इट एज ड्रग इज ए पी आई मीन एक्टिव फार्मास्यूटिकल इनग्रीडियंट is known as drug and what is api or drug any substance which give pharmacological effect is known as drug mean drug is api and what is api and any substance which give pharmacological effect is known as api or drug what is the difference between drug and dosage form as we discussed drug is api mean drug is purely active pharmaceutical ingredient and what is dosage form the combination of api plus excipients the combination of api plus excipients or inert excipients or inert ingredient is known as dosage form the next one is what is dose the amount or quantity of a drug prescribed by a practitioner to take by the patient at specified time intervals is known as dose mean a calculated amount of a drug is known as dose basically these are some basic points so from these basic points we will build our strong base and if you understand the basic concept it will be easier to build a main concept so what is dosage form if you are now familiar with dose mean the quantity of drug is known as dose the dosage form mean form of a dose in simple words form of a dose is known as dosage form don't be confused mean the form in which any drug is available in market for its use is known as dosage form and in simple words the form of dose in which it is used by the patient to give its pharmacological effect or to deliver it to the site of action is known as dosage form to take the example of dosage form you can take it by the example of paracetamol we take paracetamol in the form of tablets so it is solid dosage form we also take paracetamol in the form of liquid preparation means suspension that is liquid dosage form mean one drug is used in two forms so it has two dosage forms when we take it in form of tablets it is solid dosage form when we take it in form of suspension it is liquid dosage form daily life example to remember the dosage form and its explanation and its examples take simple example of potato take the potato as active pharmaceutical ingredient or drug mean we are asked to eat potato you can eat potato in many different ways but whatever the way you are using the ultimate goal is to eat potato mean you can eat potato by making a paratha so when you eat the paratha basically you are also eating the potato you can also eat the potato by converting it in form of samosa so if you are eating samosa you are also eating potato 
यू कैन आल्सो कन्वर्ट पोटैटो इन टू चना चाट सो इफ यू आर ईटिंग चना चाट बेसिकली यू आर ईटिंग पोटैटो मीन वी हैव वन मेन इन्ग्रीडियंट विच वॉज पोटैटो बट वी हैव डिफरेंट फॉर्म्स लाइक पराठा चना चाट समोसा दीज आर आर इट्स फॉर्म मीन दीज आर द डोजिज फॉर्म्स इन विच वी आर ईटिंग पराठा to take an other example of the dill life take the example of ginger powder ginger powder is commonly used in homes one can eat ginger powder after mixing it with sugar so you are taking ginger in form of solid dosage form which is the form of powder we can also take ginger by adding it into the milk so when we drink milk basically we are taking the ginger in the form of liquid dosage form some people also take ginger powder by adding it into the butter so as we know that butter is semi solid so when you are taking ginger powder by adding it into butter you are basically taking the semi solid dosage form of the ginger in the same way one drug can be used in different dosage forms depending upon its type of use its stability its availability there are many factors which are contributing to the formulation of dosage form we will discuss one by one so the simple concept was to deliver a main concept regarding the dosage form so i hope by watching this video you will never forget the concept of dosage form if you like the video share it to others and do subscribe my channel because in the third video we will start regarding the need of dosage forms properties of dosage forms characteristics of dosage forms and so on we will continue till its classification and description of each dosage form so also visit farminform.com to read interesting articles and do share my videos to the others till the next video allah hafiz